Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. Today is December 20th, 2011, and we, you're in the war room. This is the war room. And I'd like to thank Mayor Michael R. Bloomberg for being so good to me because I was able to go buy me some bootleg cigarettes. He started this whole black market economy. It is not illegal to buy it. It's illegal to sell it. <laughs> I buy it right here. That's $4 worth of cigarettes. I um, beat the $12 price. And I'm quitting smoking. So I'd like to thank you, Mayor Bloomberg, for raising the price so high. I can't poison myself anymore. And keep killing myself with cigarettes. You are so smart. You are so smart that right now, uh, I'm about to bust your ass in court. Hey, see right here? New York City Mayor Michael R. Bloomberg. New York City District Attorney Richard Brown, Khadija Mohammed Starling, New York City Police Department and Bernie Porter. The New York City Housing Authority with John B. Rea and Michael P. Kelly. The New York uh, City Housing Authority Tenant Association with Ozier Mitchell that robbed Mrs. Tony Green for $20,858 and got an apartment um, violating American Disabilities Act getting one of those apartments as a reward for a redlining, it is alleged. New York City Human Resource Administration, New York City Adult Protective Services, Creedmoor Psychiatric Legal Services, and Jamie Butchin, who violated her oath as an attorney to do me no harm. I'm going to get her for that. Um, Congressman, Gregory du w Congressman Weldon Meeks, I.M. Smith, Kim Fuller, New York State Senator Shirley L. Huntley and Lester Mews, New York State Senator Malcolm A. Smith, New York State, uh, New York State Assemblywoman Vivian E. Cook, New York City Councilman Leroy Comey and Rance Huff, the Queens County Clerk, General Counsel Donnie Ferry, and Bill Thompson et al. Those are the defendants, and that's the final call. That's the final roll call. By me, they go in the court. Those are the only people. It's been, everything's been abbreviated and changed, and I have two hour and a half DVDs that will accompany the 500 pages of litigation. Now, let's go inspect the house. The work is getting done. This is George number one right here. And my boy does work. He don't play. He does not freaking play. Alright? This is the house. That's the master bedroom right there with the 12 foot ceilings. That's the steps. We're going to make the railing right here. I'm in the little room. This is another bedroom right here. The bathroom is getting to the point to where we've got the jacuzzi inside. We've got the cement flooring. And now what we're going to see, we're going to go downstairs and we're going to see the real work getting done. By the master that controls disasters, <laughs> Mr. Nick. Creates or controls? Look. And somebody out there, I cannot afford this house. Somebody out there, help me out. I need $50,000 in cash. I need a benefactor. Somebody help me out here. You know what I'm doing? You know I'm fighting for black people's rights? You know that's going to cost me. It's fighting a good fight, man. All right, so I need this house. I want this house. I can afford this house. Once I've got it in my name, I get a mortgage. All right? Now, oops. Now, let's take a look at the work that's getting done. This is cardio right here. That's putting down a cement floor. They put the cement block right here. They put the cement board on top of it. It's pure rock. Cement board. You need that so that when you're walking up here and people living in the basement, it doesn't hurt them so bad. This is quality work, people. The work is getting done. Now, let's take a look at the front of this house. You see this door? That's an oak door. Next. That's fiberglass. Oh! That's maintenance free. Maintenance free? Now we gotta paint it, now we gotta do it. Woo! Just gotta look at it and enjoy it. Thank you very much. You heard it from the map. Now, let's take a look at outside. 
and see what we've got here. Look at this Tuscany villa. Look at what this piece of crap has turned into an absolute jewel in the neighborhood. Look at this. Look at that, huh? Isn't that beautiful? I just sleep on that thing inside. That's killing me. That's been fixed. Okay? Yeah, that's a street pole. You won't see where the street is at. Or, or the information on the for sale sign. That's the house. Remember what it used to look like, people? Look at this beauty right here. An absolute freaking gem. And look at the size of this backyard right here. Huh? Me and my dog. I don't bother nobody. I just need a dog. Alright, that's a huge backyard. That's a huge backyard. That's a huge backyard. And the private driveway. Come on for one night. You ain't going to the front parking spot. Mm -hmm. Just go right into your own driveway. That's it. You want to have your car secured? Pull it all the way into the back. That's it. Who's going to bother you? Nobody. Private, private separate entrance from the basement? That's it. Beautiful people. Mr. President, wouldn't you like for me to have this house called Acorn? Let me get the hookup. Governor Cuomo, you were HUD secretary selling those mortgages. You were attorney general and you got paperwork from me that you ignored that led to my homelessness. I, I, I'm bitter and all that, but I ain't mad at you, brother. I'm a French Orthodox and Catholic. Come on now, I need a little help. Help me out. I'm a good guy. All right? I'm so disenchanted with what your black Democrat did to me, Governor. And those are your boys that you used to be with in the Clinton administration. That's why they were so loyal to Hillary Clinton and betrayed Obama. That ain't none of my business. I'm a French green card guy. Right now I'm talking about a house for me to get out of homelessness. Help me out here, somebody. Hey, Kane! Can't run for president no more. How about doing a little charity work? Got some money. Help me out here. All you black celebrities out there. You see how I be tanning to the people behind us. Help me out here. You want me to get another job? Help me out here. I want to go back and sell breath testers. The shark. The show. The shark. I am a homeless guy. And I've got the best, biggest and the best product walking talking. Mm -hmm. I saved somebody's life in the New York City municipality. Tortured me. Waged a war of attrition against me. Destroyed my life. And a black elected mm -hmm. official. <laughs> they just betrayed this country, <laughs> betrayed their constituents, betrayed their race, betrayed their family, betrayed everybody. And on my birthday, I was Brandon. <laughs> 12, 23, 19, 56. Bam! Dr. Dreis needs a house. Help me out here. Okay. Instead of getting a big white standard poodle, I'm willing to get married if you got a job and a car and we can get along and we can buy this house and live in peace. Might keep me from going to Canada so soon. If at all. Help me out here, people. This is a plea. I know about 87% men watch my shows on YouTube. The politician made complaints and I can't share with Facebook or MySpace anymore. That's okay. I'm going to take them to court and bust their behind. That doesn't make me crazy. A little cocky. But when you're that good, and you can. <laughs> I can. I will. Bet on me! Bye-bye. Trust me. Bet on me. Bet on me. I saved at least two people's lives. That's confirmed. Bet on me. I'm a good guy. I want to stay that way. Bye-bye.